Hi friends, how's it going? Coltar here, back again with... I keep trying to say Mass Effect, but no. Outlast! Last time we left off, we ran away from Chris Walker. I actually... I, I was hoping to see him again. Also, wasn't wanting to see him again, because it's Chris Walker. And now we've found Father Martin! Isn't that awesome? Father Martin again. Alright, so let's continue on here. Aye! Screw you! Hey look, there's actually somebody alive in here this time. Alright, alright, calm down there. Let's read this. Rick, fun hitting the greens last week. We should make the drive more often. <coughs> Pardon me. Was reviewing some old test records from the early days of Project Wall Rider, and something sparked my interest. Were you following the project back in 2010? Apparently, we had issues with female employees experiencing psychosomatic pregnancies. Something to do with how the morphogenic engine interacts with the immune system. Uh, all Greek to me. Am I right? It was more often fatal than not, and these were employees not pa and not patients. So a little harder to sweep under the rug, but... The morphogenic engine activity in these ladies' as marrow was off the charts. And these are women who were never even exposed to additional hormone therapy... Now, I don't know PPM from a kick in the teeth, but I can read a spreadsheet. And if the projected profits from Project Wall Rider are half what they say they are, I've just got one question. We aren't... Wait, why aren't we performing experiments on women? God knows mental illness is an equal opportunity affliction. Seems unethical to pass up on such a potential windfall. Sincerely, Jerry. Odd, okay. Um... No more sickness! No more nightmares! Okay, calm down there, buddy. So it's this room again. Oh god, one of them's coming! It's not even human anymore! <laughs> oh, so that's how that happens. Okay. Interesting. I'll go down there right away. Just check out this room. Um. Aha! Battery! Makes me kind of wonder now, like, is... Was there supposed to be better? What? Oh, it's Chris again! God dang it, Chris. Chris Walker! Everybody! Chris Walker. I'm half expecting to have to, like, run into uh, Chainsaw Guy, whatever his name is. Looks like we ran way past him, because I don't even think he would have ever made it to that window. But, okay. Uh, yeah. By the way, I got light on again. Uh, not because, uh, <laughs> I was scared or anything. It's because I'm recording during the day again. Um, and I won't be able to record late tonight anyway, so I was like, you know what? This is my only chance to record it, so... Better go with it, right? Okay. I know I probably don't want to go in here, but okay. Um. Chainsaw guy out here? I'm legitimately half expecting Chainsaw guy to be out here and just go ooga booga 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 booga. <laughs> what was that? That was Courage the Cowardly Dog. Where you, like, in the beginning where he would, uh, Put on the, uh, the, what is it, the tiki mask or whatever. And you'd be like, ooga booga 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 at Courage. That was always in the, uh, the opening, I think it was. I loved Courage the Cowardly Dog. I honestly grew up on that stuff. It was wicked. What was the point in this? Oh, okay, we can jump in here. Wait, are we going through the sewers again? Oh god dang it, don't tell me we're going into the sewers again. Is there seriously another sewer level? Uh, oh no, no. Looks like it was just more of a... Oh. Okay, um... Don't need the night vision on right now. This is electrified, I don't really want to touch that. That way is open, but what's this? 
What is this? What is the point in this? Oh, battery? No? Okay, well, what is the point in that? That's blocked off. Like, I can try. No, that's a waste of time. So we gotta go... Oh. What was that? Whatever. Let's go through here. This is where it gets dark again. Uh... Oh, battery. Cool. Oh, is Chris gonna come out again? Hey, Chris! Chris! What is that from? I feel like I've heard that before. I don't know if you guys have, but I feel like I have. Chris! Is that something? I don't know, maybe I'm just losing it. Very strong possibility that I'm losing it. Okay! Not at all what I wanted to see, but okay. What am I doing? Shocker. Okay, what was the point in this? Wait, what am I doing? Okay. Oh, I turned off the power to the electric, to that electrified fans. That makes sense. Okay. Somebody's gonna be out here now, though. Or, at least, I would. You would think. No. Okay. The power is still on. Electricity. I need to think. Lisa, I thought the power was evidence that some manageable, some human force still controlled some small part of Mount Massive. But nothing human or sane can do anything here but survive. And even that, not for long. You were always the reasonable one, Lisa. You would tell me to calm down, to take a larger view. Madness and inhumanity rule this place. Whatever is keeping the electricity flowing is trying to trap me here. I need to shut it down again? No way. Do I have to go back in there? Okay. We'll head back. God dang it. Why? Like, seriously, what? Oh. Okay, stay off this time, please. Is somebody gonna jump on me? Ah! Yeah, yeah. See, I knew it was gonna happen, and yet I still, I still let it happen. I'll close the door this time. Okay. Did he just open the? I think he actually legitimately opened the door. I don't think he smashed it. I think he actually opened it. Odd. Okay. Okay, let's go through. Let's close. Yeah, there he is. He's kind of just slowly walking after me, but... I'll let him continue for now. Let's go in. Close this. Okay. What is this? What is this? This is like prime chasing, like... Situation here. Oh, I don't like this. Not one bit. At least there's lights on, though. Oh, really? Oh, really? Okay. The wall rider. I wonder if we're actually gonna have to deal with the wall rider in this one. I doubt it, but, like, I, I still wouldn't be surprised, you know? I gotta go in the water. Seriously? I don't wanna go in the water. Ugh. If, if amnesia has taught me anything, don't go in the water. You know? Whatever. Okay, here we go! What the heck is that? Come on now. No need for that. No need for that at all. Uh, what? No, I don't want to go down the ladder. What the heck? Come on, man. Stay away from the ladder. Uh, let me just quickly check what's this. Oh, it's just a light. Okay. Um. Locked. Uh. Oh, battery. Cool. Thank you. Um, no? Okay. Um. Okay. Oh! It was locked, but there's a giant hole in the bottom of it. I'm gonna actually reload my battery. What the balls was that? Was it this? Was that what scared me? God dang it. Ugh. 
It was the noise that scared the crap out of me, not even like what it was even there. I don't care about no dead body. <laughs> it's the music. That's one of the things that make horror, makes horror games scary, is it's music. Honestly, like, if it doesn't have freaky music and a freaky atmosphere, it's not going to be a scary game. It's not necessarily the the, the enemy that is scary. It, it's, it's seriously the atmosphere, the way they made the game, stuff like that. I feel like i got to jump out that window. Yeah. Like, it, it's, it's, seriously, like, if, like, I, I would hope that people agree with me on that one, just because it, it's, to me, that's 100% true. You have to have a good atmosphere in a game, in a horror game, for it to legitimately be freaky. Freaky deaky. Okay. So I could have gone down some stairs back there. So there is, like, the entrance to Mount Massive. So behind it... Literally. So there's Mount Massive, the asylum. And then behind the entire facility is an entire prison. And underneath the entire facility is a giant scientific testing facility of, like, doom and stuff. Like, it's crazy. What? Oh, come on now. Don't fall down. No. Oh, God. You fell through a bu the building. Ew. Mm mm. Okay. Sip of iced tea. Jeez. These main characters just don't have any luck, do they? Do I still have the camera? Oh, yeah, I do. What the heck was that? That was weird. That was really weird. Oh, I don't like how close quarters this is. Ugh. Why do you need a goat? A small piece of flesh between us and the blade. You wanna give him the Gluskin. That's the idea. I, I, I don't want to get Okay, guys. What what are you doing, people? Come on! What no, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to go this way. I'm waiting to get grabbed or something. Gift for the groom. Oh, is somebody getting married here or something? Like, come on now. Oh, don't do that. I don't like that. I hate that noise. It sounds like it literally sounds like somebody's like running at you. I kind of think that was the point, but still, doesn't mean I hate it any less, you know. Okay, just run. Oh hey, back inside. Like the harder. I try to escape the deeper I get. Dead men aren't any aren't a surprise more. Suicide seem wise. So this is this is an employee. That was very clearly an employee. Jeez, all these close quarters! No, I don't like it. Okay, sorry. The man downstairs. What? What's so bad about the man downstairs? Kill the rats! He's here! Inside the walls! Kill him! Uh what? I don't wanna die! I'm trying to survive. I'm trying to escape. Not die. Oh, should probably change my uh, battery, eh? How many batteries do I have? I have four. Okay, I'm still doing pretty good here. Like... Where are you? I'm almost certain I'm gonna end up getting caught by these guys, but hey, whatever. Interloper. 
Like, come on now. I want to see these people. I want to see what they actually look like. <laughs> because, uh, I feel like they're gonna end up looking the exact same as all the other people, but at the same time, I feel like they actually do have a different look. Oh, I gotta go up here. Okay. What is up here? There he is! What do you think? Oh, he'll do. Wait, for once we agree. Yeah, he just looks normal. Okay. Hey, don't hit me. That's rude. Okay, it doesn't look like I really need the night vision on. But it's probably best if I have the night vision on. Up and over. The per these people have such, like, higher voices, you know what I mean? The groom will have us. So who's this groom? That's, that's my biggest question. Who the heck is the groom? Uh, down here I go. Down the stairs I go. Here comes the bride, what? Who's the bride? Uh... What the heck? Um... What? That is disgusting! A man's body, mutilated and bent to mimic or mock the moment of birth. The kind of thing a man cannot see without changing in some irreparable way. Lisa, I was with you when both our boys were born. It was, until recently, the most miraculous thing I had seen. Completely outside of reasonable belief, and yet somehow central to everything I have come to believe since. You always said I was too literal-minded, tried to turn everything into an infinite... Into an if-then statement. Lately, I've widened my horizons. How can the things I've seen here be? But I know the answer. Money. Profit. Things we made just because we could. Jeez, that is messed up. That is beyond messed up. I'm sorry. What? Oh, hey. I'm starting to think this game's not, like, scaring me anymore because I just... I, okay, it does. It does. I can't say it doesn't. But it, it's... it's... Like, I'm still getting scared. But I, I'm more willing to literally just run. Like, just... Ugh. Ah! Jeez! Is that the groom? Like, I get the jump scares and stuff. Uh, like, that, that, that freaks me out. Or when somebody appears out of nowhere. Or uh, to deal with something. What? So you must be the groom. What am I supposed to do? Straight up, what am- Whoa! He's big. He's actually kind of big. I'm gonna slow down while doing this, though. Like, ow! Jerk, man! God dang it, I'm dead. I'm so- Yep. Oh, God, yep. The groom just killed me. I didn't want to die. I didn't want to die! Hmm. What was I supposed to do? Was I supposed to juke him out and run? Oh, yeah. That's probably what I was supposed to do. Okay. Um, so that's where I go back. This is where he is. Hey there. Look back up. Boom. What? Oh! Are you sure you didn't mean to? Okay, yeah, I think I need to juke him out here. And then head back. Okay. Okay, run back. Go. Quick. Go. 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 I can make it. I don't know exactly where I need to go, but... Ah, here. Close the door. Nicely. Okay, go through here. And keep going. Okay. Oh. Love makes a house whole. Or, home? Home, yes. Okay. Okay. 
Go, go, go. This guy is insane. He's gonna take this battery. Uh. Just keep going. Go, go, go. He's gonna appear right away. That's my guess, but, uh... But hey, whatever, right? Oh! No, I don't wanna be! Go! Oh, holy, okay. Uh, no way. Really? Oh my god, again? Mm. Oh my god, whoa! I didn't do that to myself. Rather die than be with me. That guy is insane. Oh, I'm limping and everything too. Are you serious right now? Uh, okay, yeah. Well, you know what? I am actually going to end the video here then. Uh, so if you guys enjoyed the video, please do leave a like. And of course, hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. So, with that, my friends, the video is over. Bye! A lot more running. It seems to be all I seem to be doing in this in this DLC, and there's nothing wrong with that. It's just like I, that fear that I keep talking about, where oh god, dang it, just go. That fear that I talk about, where that kind of stuff terrifies me the most. It still does, but it's not bothering me as much as it normally would right now.